Welcome to another edition of Fitness Friday Politics, where on Fitness Friday, it is always the best day of the week. Gotta love it. Folks, where's Walter? Where's Rochelle? You never know. <laughs> Isn't that the truth? But today is July 17, 2022, and I am here in my fitness room of the Hampton Inn and Suites, here in the heart of the Mississippi Delta, Greenville, Mississippi. Gotta love it. And folks, this is actually, you've heard me mention in past Fitness Friday episodes in years past, um, certainly an episode recently, uh, but also this is a very important part of my family history, family lineage. I'm here in the Delta, this is the birthplace of my parents, good old Oscar and Lorette Smith. And so my dad was the second oldest, was the second oldest of 15, and my mom, there were 10 of them, but her twin died at childbirth. So we used to have massive reunions here. Back in the day, you can only imagine how many cousins I have, and we're all spread out all over, aunts and uncles as well. But folks, it's always great to be back here in the Delta, but it's also great to be continuing my fitness, remaining committed to my fitness journey while on the road and traveling. And so folks, it's all while it's important, yes, to maintain our fitness, but it's also important to reflect on our family lineage and particularly as it relates to health, fitness, and wellness, and some of the decisions that were made by others, uh, certainly before us, um, how they can certainly impact our lives today. So I reflect back on you know, how my parents you know, got married here, young, poor, struggling couple, and then my dad actually, you know, young married couple at Mississippi State University, he enrolled, he majored in physical education. So as I've shared in years past, I, I got some of those lessons early about fitness um, as a child, very young child, the importance of being physically active and being involved in sports and all that back in the day. And so it is so important to just reflect on how, you know, decisions that others have made and how they positively impact us. After we graduated from Mississippi State, Came back, came back here, talked for a while, and then joined the Navy. And that's actually how I ended up being a Navy, Navy baby. Um, so things were just interesting. Just so, you know, I look back in hindsight, of course, being right here, where we often say where things started, um, and just how important some of those early decisions were. And, and just, you know, I'm just very humbled, and I'm just very grateful. I'm just very, very grateful. And we have to recognize folks that are passion for fitness or passion for health certainly can extend not only not only just ourselves, you've heard me mention this on a, on a previous episode, that, that our, our, our fitness decisions, our health decisions, not only impact us, but they can impact our immediate family, our extended family, and certainly those in our community, and where we travel, whatever the case may be. So recognize our commitment to fitness, our commitment to health, can have ripple effects that can last for generations to come. So let's continue to remain fit, committed. Let's continue to remain, keep our fitness at the forefront of our minds, at the forefront of our lives as we move forward um, in life and just recognize truly what a gift it is, what a gift it is. So the positive impacts of fitness, just the, the positive health benefits, and there's so many different benefits I can get into. And then literally one of them is summarized. You can see the tagline here at this particular location. They have different taglines at different locations I've noticed. And you can see here on this side of me, behind me, act now, feel good later. Think about that. Just wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. All right, and I've highlighted, yes, edge fitness and how beneficial that is. You know, better out there starts in here. So you know, make the initial steps inside of the gym, inside, inside the studio or fitness facility. For some people at their home, you know, buying some type of fitness equipment or machine. Just fitness, just a, a, a just a incredibly transformative life can begin with that single step. With that single step. So, so, so important, folks. But it's time for me to get this workout started, so I'm keeping this short and sweet. And stay tuned for next week. I cannot wait to continue these fitness discussions and conversations. But until then, remember, I'm positively passionate about your fitness and success and family lineage. And you'll see